Or at least naamoy balikan ba? So it really helped me a lot in college when I had um we don't have mice events before way back 2016 or 2015 mice events were just developing at that time so before we call it events management but when I was in college you know we had the subject events management so wala kay may gakuan na may mga theories theories ginagmay no but, but we were more into hands on activities where we help organize school activities we help evaluate the said school activities so meaning every after activity we have like an evaluation sheet and we also distribute it to the participants to see if naabay need improve sa among activity nga gi-organize as a mandapit may mag nag fall short or needs improvement. Yeah, indot kay siya because uh, those activities that we did when I was in college, I was able to bring that when I became a teacher. So when I was also tasked to organize like activities, it was actually quite easy for me to to start. Kay it's very ano, it's very intricate kon kay siya. Kwagi siya nga activity class because First, not only that, gano'n ko na panandaan ka sa budget o asa ang, sin- ang uh, distribution of task, but you also need to man other people. So, you need to organize other people as well. So, dapat distribute mo ang mga trabaho nila. Like, for example, oh, for, we are going to organize like a student night. So, what are the active programs at ito ang ikuan? Unsa man atong program na student night? So, pila man siya ka-hours. So, kung usually, pinakadugay naman sa mga events kay mga 2 to 3 hours. So, unsa between that 2 to 3 hours so sa mga activities ana when magsugod jud ang program and then what time siya mag-end. And then afterwards, unsa mga things nga needed nimo like decorations, no? At the same time, if you have like games, prizes palandaan, pila ka book prizes imong i-prepare, pila ka book ang winners, no? In in every like game. Or for example, if there's like a show, kinsa ang una mo perform, no? Kinsa sunod? No, and then ang person in charge pa jud ana nga mag-collect sa music, no, na stage manager or stage director, no? And then ang sa kuan pa na is ang food tana no? So daghan ka ayo kag consider in, in preparing just a very simple event. So how much more if you're preparing like for a conference or a webinar we're in, they need um other things, no? Compared to like an event we're in I decorations and all lahi ang iyang set up po so you need to also understand the different kinds of needs for different events if it's a corporate event then medyo may pagka na ay very professional and very clean ang ang decorations sa stage pero no very simple ang lettering rin siya or for example kung if you can afford a, a LED screen more na siya din ay mag mag logo ra sa sa for example sa organization nga na-organize na ng event and then ang name sa event, nothing say that, or tarpaulin ra ba ron. And then, importante ana is, you have like strong Wi-Fi connection, um, the panels are also informed, kinsay una mo discuss. So, daghan, no? So, introduction pala niya, wala pa takakasagod sa klase. So, hopefully, all throughout, because I'm actually also um, reading the book, if you can find this in the library, um, events management, there are activities here related to mice where you can make your own like, concept concept paper, event concept paper. Na apo diri ang imaghimo ka og kanang mag an assessment sa events. Although na ama na sa sa ARS sino per mag pwede pong maghimo og inyo ha para kabalod jud mo on how to assess if ang if successful bang ba event. If makabantay mo kada webinar inyong apilan or na may activity apilan na jud may feedback form. It's really important, no? Nya yeah, maghi na putay mga activities we're in. Um, we can identify no within the within the uh, shell exhibition space no a label po nato siya kay appeal po biya na siya class dili ka siya maklaro no kay sa kung background pero mag layout po mo even ang sitting like for example kung mao ni siya ang kadakoon sa conference room unsa so, ama to pag arrange sa mga bangko like nya batay presidential table ipa classroom ra ba siyang arrangement or pa u shape so pati ka na no appeal pod na siya so all throughout siguro with this subject we will have activities such as this one even though we can't actually meet personally and organize these events personally but we can even organize kanang kuan lang mga mga online nga kun or makatabang po ta we can assist even activity sa RSC baro no na tay mag si ka usa lang na tay hands on activity jud nga kita mismo mo organize og event then the rest is kuan na siya um, mga activities where you plan you no know, you make um like for example 
a seat plan. You will also make like a layout of the conference room. You try to organize an event where you fill out all the things that you need. So, no. Okay, so let's start. Let me just open my... Okay, open the file. So, one is atong schedule, ha? Kinsige to kung gibaylo gay nga schedule sa inyo, ha? Ka, Sir Melbert pa to, tong sa buntag siya, dayon ako na ang sa hapon, or sa third year tong nga subject. Tamo, damo. Ah, okay. Ah, so nag-switch me, pero sa fourth year nga subjects na nan. Kay, din ako ka-keep track do, kay sa kadaghan, o subjects na sa tourism, yun, lain-lain, ang mga teachers gahandol. So, yung usap-usap sila nag-schedule, First year gani, I'm skiing second week now or third week. They were still adjusting to their new schedule, so it takes a lot of adjustment. Oh, I'm in class. Okay. Class day, sorry. Wala ka lang yun, Tiri. For a while pa sa akong document, di pang yuta na wala. Okay, Nara. Sorry, sorry. Okay, so before we will start, let us pray first. In the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit, Amen. O glorious Saint Rita, you who did share in a marvelous manner the sorrowful passion of our Lord Jesus Christ, give me the grace to suffer in patience the miseries of this life, and be my refuge in all my necessities. Amen. Saint Rita, pray for us in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. And so, good afternoon, everyone. So, welcome to the continuation of Introduction to Meisterism. Next week, we will... Um, continue with uh, like a deeper understanding of mice no so we will be able to know also the different kinds of exhibitions later on although in here i will also show you like the different kinds of events under mice so the deeper lang put the next week we will have also an activity wherein um you will be able to know how to um have like a criteria for evaluating mice venues so naaputay we an activity to also on, uh, measure how much is your understanding in Meisterism. So last time, if you can remember, no, um, we've defined Meisterism, which is meetings, incentives, conventions, or exhibitions or events. So sometimes conventions in other, in other MICE definitions, sometimes they call convention as congresses. So we differentiate know what is meeting, how it differs to incentives, conventions, and exhibitions, although they belong into the same industry, you know, events industry, events tourism, but they have different activities. So, di ba, ang meetings are like corporate con conferences, no nga, where businessmen would meet together, you know, they would share ideas, or for example, like breakthroughs, or um, they would like to build partnerships, no, with a company. So, mo na siya ang sa meetings, no. For example, na like board meetings for corporate groups, financial seminars for overseas investors. Ang incentives are, you know, activities organized by a company, um, geared towards their, um, 
employees. Okay, for example, if they are doing very well for this fiscal year, na, na meet nila ang quota or for example, um, they were able to earn a huge amount of income sa ilahang business. No? So, si company would organize like an activity or like a trip, incentive trip wherein um, all the employees will enjoy no, at the same time, we reward na nila for a job well done. Their example for the incentive is not only for like awarding or like, um, for example, reward purposes. Ang oban po rana is, mara siya year start activity nga for their em- the employees to bond together to have like a strong relationship with each other. So na asila ka ng mara ano mara siya og retreat or like a corporate. Um, incentive travel, bonding sila tanano kay para at least they will be able to perform very well at the start of that year. Kaya nga, they believe nga if, of course, na ay uh, like mutual or healthy relationships ang ang co-workers with each other, you know, the more sila mo, mo cooperate or na ay teamwork. No? So, ang uban po, ang incentive travel are not given like by group, sometimes it would be awarded individually for a high-performing employee. So, mo na siyang incentive travel. Next is ang convention. So, conventions are sometimes it could be like general assemblies of associations, academic conferences, no? Mag-meet together ang mga members of this association or this organization to discuss on say mga activities or program nga ilahang um implement for this year no for the improvement of their organization or how they will encourage um, more members not to be part of their organization makita ni mo na siya if you are a member na of JTHMAP diba every month or kanang every year na sila mga ganap always no like booth camp or congresses even sa ARSC diba katong mga old students na ko diri kabalo man sud mana nga na mga ARSC congress no depende na if kanang local provincial or national were in no members of that um, organization would meet together with elect um new set of officers no na mga trainings and all so that's an example of a convention next kay events or exhibition so sometimes it could be cultural or sporting events no such as sa olympics no or for example kana mga art exhibits showcasing a different works of artists no it could be no paintings baron or even fashion no so naghan ano yung mga example di ba like Tokyo International Film Festival World Championship in Athletics Asia Basketball League in Tokyo or Motor Show International Jewelry Tokyo so anything that showcases art or sports or anything that's more in like sports and entertainment cultural and the arts it's under events and exhibitions so, why na elaborate to further things required in a mice um, destination? Okay, daghan meron siya needed. So, let's now proceed with basic terms and concepts of mice. Before we will proceed, I would like to show you this video. Or mas ma-appreciate po dyan nato ang maesterism, no? Are you hearing all the hype about mice? But do not know what mice actually is? What, mice? <laughs> Could it be the ones shown on TV? No, think bigger. Hmm, then what is it? The real mice consists of meetings, incentive travel, conventions, and exhibitions. We organize meetings with a planned agenda to come up with solutions. Enjoy incentivized travel around the world in recognition of your company's performance. We gather professionals of an industry in conventions to exchange perspectives. And we showcase the products or services of companies in exhibitions. MICE offers you glitz and glamour, an endless adventure of fun, and you can always make friends everywhere and anytime. We may make the best laid plans of mice and men, 
but we always adapt and think on our feet. We are able to allocate our resources effectively, apart from managing our time well. And to us, when we talk about professionalism, it is something we always uphold. Some say we are as poor as church mice for the amount of hours we put into an event. We work really hard, but wealth is more than just money. By the very nature of the mice industry, we are connected everywhere around the world. This means that at the end of the day, our extensive network that we build is our net worth. With Singapore being Asia's top convention city for the 12th consecutive year, and the world's easiest place to do business for the 8th time, there is no time to remain as quiet as a mouse in this booming industry. We are the people who bring people together. We are the mice industry. Join us today. Okay, so that is a maestrism. So let's try to look at maestrism in the Philippines. Let me just stop sharing this tab. Actually, we will also elaborate on the three C's of mice. Kay, di ba, usahay, na iuban mo define sa mice as meetings, incentives, conventions, and events. Na iuban ay lahang C and I instead of conventions, congress, no, or conference. So you'll also define that no, because dili man ingon nga sayop to ilaha kay abig ang ilahang mice dito ang C nila is ang C nila is congress nya ang kamom lagi kay conventions nya what's the word ang tinuod no so actually all of those three C's are correct no and we will also define them individually because congresses are different from conventions conventions are different from conferences no so to panas lang i-define Okay, very broad. Ano ano ka broad ang my tourism class nga to the point nga you can just fuse like a type of event nga more siya niya ang ang part sa my so daghan magklase nga events nga ga include like kung ano meetings and all no nga nga all people gather together no we share ideas share breakthroughs so daghan klase nga part sa my tourism. Let's try to Um, look at a promotional video from the Department of Tourism, on the Tourism Promotions Board, which is Mice Industry in the Philippines. So, again, you know, just like Singapore and Thailand, who have been making a lot of efforts to become like one of the premier mice tourism industries in Asia, or mice tourism destinations in Asia, the Philippines has been constantly also developing. So, we're not only fixed on on promoting the philippines as like a beautiful natural destination or a cultural tourism destination but we are also you know putting efforts into developing infrastructure so that we are also um become one of the leading mice um destinations no in asia or hopefully in in asean okay kwan mangud siya class um again like what i've said last meeting uh big money making Janisha nga industry. Okay? People are always hungry for new information, new knowledge. That is why they always travel. Sige, ako man siguro nga as a professional, I would rather invest my money into joining like congresses or conventions because I would learn like a new skill. No, It would even add like, uso po na karun nga, the more po ka nga certification sa imo nga, nakakuan ka nga skill or for example, nakakuan ka certification because you attended this kind of workshop, the more siya maka-add sa imo nga work, no? It's also like a prestige as well, no? It it also help promotes your career. So, a lot of people have been doing that lately, no? Before the pandemic, even until now, gani nga, we have brought the platform online because, It provides a lot of benefits. Not only you're going to meet a lot of people, be able to share your ideas, but you'll, you'll be able to learn as well. No, so muna, people are always hungry for new knowledge. You're always hungry for like, what are the new trends? How can I keep up? No, knowing that people are so competitive now, competitive, competitive nowadays. So how can we keep up? No, so mga anak. 
So, mo na siya nga, very kuanjo kay siya. And it's very appealing to not just businessmen. Okay, so yung mga mag maesterism for businesses, sir, na siya. No, it's even quite very appealing to um, the culture and the arts, no? Um, education or in the academe, no? And even ko adput gani, um, sa sports, di ba? So, daghan siya ka ayo ang murag jam pack na na siya tanan ang naa sa maesterism, no? So, let's try to watch a promotional video from the OT. So, this is mice in the Philippines. Okay. Nag ring siya meaning was it able to successfully share the video. Let me just share it again for at least my audio. Okay. So that is mice in the Philippines. Now, if you've noticed, it's you know, usually when you think about mice, diba business meetings are not sha, pero they even incorporated there some parts of like holiday no, or naay mga tropical ko and activities because again, mice is so much more than just business activities. No, there's incentive travel, so there are insert ng kanang mga recreational activities, leisure activities, no, and even gani mga businessmen, even if they go on business trips, they would always find time to travel and to, to go for like sightseeing, no, a lot just lag gamay nga time sa ilhang business schedule nga mo agto ba sila og mall baron or magto sa kanang nga beach, no, okay, because just nearby sa katong city kung asa siya nag nagstay. No, and um, mice is very beneficial because not only nga itself, naghang ako ang screen, sensya. Okay, so not only itself as a destination nga mice jud siya, no? It can even help promote other types of tourism, no? It can even promote a cultural tourism or kanaganing mga local attractions in the city kay tungod ang purpose o sa ka traveler kay maaten siya mice events pero again mungita siya gamay nga time para makalaag laag so maka benefit po siya sa uban nga types of tourism not just sa mice so yung anak kanindot ang mice tourism class no pagbitaw sa tourism industry siya jud ang pinakadako jud nga sector no if you compare it to educational tourism if you compare it to business tourism cultural tourism mura na siya og all in one na siya ang mice Okay, so let's continue. Okay, so can you see my screen? Yes, ma'am. Okay, so let's try to understand the basic terms and concepts in mice. Now, after all, this is just an introduction. So later on, I will also explain no kaning three C three Cs because. It could be very confusing, but no, because sa uh, mice, lain la you no. Know, sometimes convention, sometimes conference, sometimes congress. So tapos lang understand later on. So let's start first with um letter M. No, just meetings. Meetings bring people together in one place for the purpose of sharing information and discussing and solving problems. Meeting attendance can range from ten to thousands of people. During a meeting, they will usually be food and beverage served. So that is why class no katukong niingon nga 
Sir Anay Minister PG ato, siya nga, dili mong good siya lalim, mag-organize ta og mice events, kay appeal na po na dira ang catering. No, kompleto na siya na, na, not just accommodation, not just like an events, um, like a convention center, no, or an attraction, appeal na po na siya ang kanang catering, no, technology, dapat kompleto na sa kanang like projectors and all. I think you already had an idea of that, no, because we discussed that last time sa ang mga things required in a mice event. So, mo na siya, no? Um, it really depends as well as the meeting type. Um, I remember every time that we have like a workshop or a conference, it's na siya mawala nga na ay like mga meals, no? In between seminars. Because sometimes we have working lunches. Mo na sa meetings, no? We conduct working lunches because the days no, we're allotted to have the meeting. Like for example, we will have only a meeting within this day and then mo ulit na me in a kagabi eh. Sometimes, the things that we discuss during the meeting is dilit nun siya ma-solve right away or kulang kami sa time. That's why we do working lunches. So, muna nga, it, there has to be, like, it has to be food and sometimes it, it's really advisable if gamay ra gani yun, walay convention center gani sa lugar, maski ang hotel na asya conference room nga makakater o ka ng huge number of participants and na asya like restaurant para ditsun lang dayon no, ang catering. So, most of the time, meetings refer to corporate meetings, which are held by companies in the following way. So there are different kinds of meetings class. No, You have board meetings, management meetings, shareholder meetings, training seminars, meeting with partners, suppliers, and clients, especially for big corporations, product launches. Now, like for example, you're going to launch a new product to a new place, no, to a new market. So appeal po na siya, no? strategic planning and even retreats. So, kana mga team building activities, meetingan po na nila, no? Kay, of course, you're going to organize man an activity involving your employees. So, when we talk about board meetings, these are meetings of the board of the directors of the corporation, usually held annually. So, if you can remember, I don't know if I've discussed this to you, but um, there is like a hierarchy, no? Diba? Sa top management, middle management, or lower management. Those who actually belong in the top management who are CEOs, shareholders, um, ko ano ka nang ang owners of the company. Because sometimes the CEO is not the owner, no. Kung uh, employed po siya sa owner at tag iyajud sa company. So these are meetings um held by the top management, no. And they only do this one once a year, no. Usually at the very beginning of the fiscal year, because ang ilahan na is major decisions maguna. And when they make major decisions, it has to be like long term. So, di siya, unlike siya sa lower management or middle management, na very frequent ang meeting because they're only um, concerned with day-to-day -day activities or day-to-day -day operations. Unlike sa top management, kailahang concern is ang entire company, Jude. So, usually, it would take a lot of time preparing. Muna, kung mag-board meeting sila, class, entire year report yun ang i-present. O last year, this is our like, performance as a company. And if we're going to compare it to our competitor, so maya ni siya to ang um, position in the market or oh, things like that, no? And then maya ni siya ang annual budget nga mo apong i-propose for this year. Kahit tungod, we, um, we would like to have like an improvement sa kanina department. So dapat ma-purchase naging ani nga, ano? So maya ni siya ang under sa mong budget. So tanan, tana, no? The things that will make the com company, you know, um, like, prosper for that year. Muna lang i-discuss during board meeting. So, once a year rin na siya. Usually, if you, if you have um, guests like this, they would really opt for a very private room and then air-conditioned with Wi-Fi na ay white screen. So, like ko ano before because when um, sa Crown Agency, when I had my OJT, usually, um, you know, ang kaning mga meeting areas nga yung ani, wala siya ginabutang sa kanang mga function halls ito sa obos. Nadyo na siya dila doon sa office sa um, ang general manager and sometimes gani na ana siya sa pinakababaw kay kuwan na siya. Not only for privacy but ang kuwan siya ana niya is at the same time layo po siya sa kanang mga guests no kay kuwan na ilang usually discuss there na very sensitive matters and then overflowing coffee tanan so nakasulay po mi ana og kanang prepare og ana nga room when I was when I was an OJT in Crown sa una so very small ra no mga long presidential table ra na mga chairs dira and then I white screen no na I overhead projector 
and then sometimes in a very private room. Okay, next is management meetings. So the managers from different regions of a corporation meet when necessary to make decisions for the corporation. So this is, um, like for example, once mahoma na ang, ang nasa top management sa ilang annual meeting, so they would relay what they have discussed o kung sila dapat implement nila. Sometimes it is in a form of a minutes of the meeting. Nga, yeah, lahi ang minutes of the meeting nila, it's very formal na ay mga resolution resolutions, no? Muna i-present nila sa middle management. So of course, ang manage ang management nga na belong dira, muna siya ang mo meet na sa base ning transpire sa top management ng meeting, no? kaning board meeting. So ano man ang... ang ang flow of of information man good na ay, na ay kasabutan ang top management pagka man lang i-relay sa middle management ang middle management ang mo breakdown para mo na ilahang i-discuss sa lower management para ma-implement dayon sa mga employees so, yana, no? so managers from different regions of a corporation meet when necessary to make decisions for the corporation sometimes kinsa man ang mga kwan ane participants ani sa management meetings so you have the different managers from different departments na ay tong marketing manager na na as a sales and probably naman as sales and marketing usar naka department unya na as a kuan sa uh, front office nga manager housekeeping supervisor baron no so tanan nga mga heads for different departments mo na siya ang um you know participants in the management meetings so, next are shareholder meetings. So, lahi na ang board meetings po sa shareholder meetings. Sometimes, um, separate siya because there are other investors who are outside of the company, but they share, they own a share in the company. So, they meet quarterly. Board meetings are held annually. So, ang shareholders meetings is quarterly. No? Because, of course, they would like to discuss if how the company is performing. If it's performing well, then the shareholder will surely benefit. No? Kay, parsa na, I own, I own, malin sa mga tele, telenovela, no, I own 60% of the shares in this company. Oh, hilas kayo, no? So, 60% of earnings and ang company, no, they actually earn that. So, um, you know, it's really important also to have this kind of meetings because, again, you're a shareholder, no? you own at least siguro mga 20 or 30% shares in this company. If it's not performing well, then it will really greatly affect you because you're investing your money in this company and you're only um, to be given the very small amounts of money right? it's not performing well. So sometimes they even um, contribute to you know, helping make decisions for the corporation because if they see that if this decision will put the company in jeopardy no, or, or in, in at the risk, no, isila po, kag-invest ba sila kwarta? Kag-invest ko kwarta di rin niya, ang ending, ani, wala di ko yung makuha or kanang kuan, malugi di ay ang, ang negosyo, no? So, we will make decisions for the company to, uh, to stay afloat at the same time, um, it will be performing very well. So, one at siyang shareholder meetings. Sometimes this uh, this kind of meeting can naaraman within the the building jud sa company, no? Pero oftentimes when they meet like abroad or outside of the kay naman na sila choice class. Di mo ka nga all the time should they will have a meeting jud within sa ilang company. Sometimes they will have meetings in hotels, no? Kay magsabot sila nga lain ilang meeting place. So, pwede man, no? So, that is why na-adjo na siya sa na na siya sa mga hotels class or sa kanang mga dago nga nga, nga uh, business hotels no? kanang mga separate po nga rooms. Kay, it's not all the time that we offer big um, conference rooms, no? Kaya kinahalan po ka og smaller meeting rooms. So, bitaw na siya sa ano na eh? Um, sa convention center po. SMX, mabuan na siya, nalimot ako. So, mga dagko po ng convention centers, they even have smaller rooms for smaller groups of people. No, kay intended man na siya for like shareholder meetings, management meetings, or even board meetings. So, kanan lang small groups ra. Dili ka ng pang congress na jud or pang, pang convention na jud nga kadagko. No? Kinahanglan po, na po na yung mga gagmay po ng rooms to accommodate these types of meetings. Okay, next, training seminars. So, a company conducts this to train the employees when needed. So, especially during uh, mga big companies, no, nya, na sila yung morag season wherein they hire um, new employees, no, kay, 
moritar na ba, na abiro dang ilahang ang ilang mga empleyado no na yung mga karaan na dito ilan ang ipa-retire so muhar na po sila new people and then in order for them to be trained so na na sila yung mga seminars po no mga dagko nga corporations class usually ilan lang ginatapok ang mga bag-o po and not only just mga bag-o nga hire even kanang mga daan na nga employees kay kinahanglan po bisag refresher po no kay na may mga times po nga malimot na sila no unsa ang kanang ang um, proper things nga nga buhato no sa ilang company so they have to be like retrained no so mo na siya it's really important to train your employees because again if ginahan po ka nga successful po no ang ang uh, operations sa inyong company and at the same time na quality no very effective and efficient imong mga employees really need to train them no and also even inform them of the corporate culture nga para maka-adjust sila no on sa il- Uh, imulod silang orient nga dapat say mo og vision or or goal no sa company and the next is meeting with partners suppliers and clients so a gathering to discuss business de- uh, business deals usually held with little little prior notice so sometimes gani no this is not already kanang nay times kan dili po kaayo siya scheduled na no kana gani murag impromptu ra most especially if There is a sudden change of a supplier. No, automatically. Okay, why not? Let's meet this weekend. Then, or go on at this place. Kaninga nga go on. Kaninga hotel to discuss. You know, um, our partnership with you. So, ingan na no. Because sometimes a company would like to extend. No, ang ilaha pa jud nga 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 company with other partner nga company so magiksan sila partnership para mas madako pa jud ang ilang company no. Or for example, they would like to um. Get a new supplier, no? Because they're gonna kaisila ng mga customers, or they're opening a new kind of product. So many of them, no meetings with partners, suppliers, and even clients. Next, product launches. So usually, a meeting with clients, the public, and journalists and reporters when new products are announced on the market. Sometimes when they do like launching of a product, e ano pagani na siya? Mapresa Apple ba nung na ano siya? Kanang like ang potential customers na adira ang media no, or journalist and even kanang public itself no kay magimuhang kung mag product launch kay mo da yung i, i showcase on same new features of the product how much siya when siya i launch jud or sa sa mga stores no and then hatag pugay ka mga vouchers din sa mga naka-attend sa product launch no kay para na sila yung mga discounts dar na sila yung kanang mga like additional perks so mo na siya ang product launches it's still part of meeting so Mula ginahin mo sa Apple if makabantay ka, ano na, say, i-launch nga, bago na po nga phone, ila ding i-explain, ano, say, mga features, no, and pagka man, ilahan ng murag i-demonstrate, then yun, mayungo din sila, kano, sa siya i-release, no, sa market, no. So, kana. Next is strategic planning. Managers meeting with employees discuss the future of the company. So, this one is na ana sa lower management na we're in. Si manager, nakuha na siya og directives from the top management, so, ilan na ding i-discuss nga, okay, mo, ni ang mga plano sa higher up no and then this is what we're going to do in order to achieve the goals that they want to to meet no so mo ni siya tong buhaton so kani nga department this is what you're going to do natay changes for this department so things like that no tanan nga plano maghimo sa during the board meetings or management meetings si implement na siya by of course discussing that with the employees during the strategic planning meeting importante po na na communication nga dili ra kutob sa mga managers ang information nga gi discuss next kay retreats so the entire company staff spends a day or two together to participate in team building activities training seminars and strategic planning session so um usually in other corporate comp- corporate nga mga businesses no ang ilaha ana is um they talk about strategic planning sessions in the morning so when, when they get to like Um, a secluded place, no, or and they can also um, have team building activity. So they discuss that first in the morning, and then the, in the afternoon they have team building activity. So maybe they play volleyball or nasilay ka ng mga games nga dulaon. And then in the evening na asilay mga barbecue, mga cookout, and then sa morning na napun sila activity. So ingan na, no. Next is incentives. That is, that's the second letter in MICE, no? So, ang letter I. So, incentive travel is a management tool for rewarding and motivating sales representatives. 
dealers, distributors, production workers, support staff, and in some cases, customers. So the company rewards sales representatives who reach sales targets by sending them on trips. So they have like an incentive trip, no? All paid expense na na siya. So usually, ang kani incentive trip no it comes with hotel stay so paid na mong hotel room na na tour packages and planned activities such as dinners parties and games so the company actually organizes like an itinerary for you so ikaw mag relax lang ka no ang mo na lang siguro imo eh, ang dadon ana is pocket money na lang para balon-balon kay kumo palit kag mga souvenirs and all even ganin ay uban nga because you're doing so well in the company you'll be given like a pocket money put as well no so you can like by other things no so basically incentive travel does not have any business related activity it's simply just like a reward for a job well done and usually this is really quite common um in the us and europe no because again people there are much more let's say more into quality at the same time kan kay sila no kanang they're quite frank with it comes to performance performance based man juga ayo na ang US ug ang Europe good no unlike sa Asia ng more on like building relationships first so they if they see that you're really doing well and you are like a valuable asset to the company then of course you'll be rewarded handsomely okay so it's still developing in other countries in Asia not all because of course no if you look at countries like here in the Philippines of poor working conditions less reward and acknowledgement sa ilang employees but there are still other countries in Asia that are like the US provides like a reward you no know, for for ko you know, for high performing employees so countries like Singapore and Japan they do that no how i wish no kay diri ko ano man ato ano murag it ty ra thank you ana ra then of course it's not enough na it's not enough to improve our morale or motivate us anymore no So factors behind incentive travel decision. So many mga factors nga no um incentive travel is provided to the employee. So um incentive budget economy. How strong is the economy in the country in which the sponsoring group is headquartered? Mo po na siya ang factor nga i-consider no kay you cannot just easily give like an incentive travel to your employee if your company cannot afford it. So it makes sense po no kay para sa nang diri sa Philippines nga dili pa mangani maabot sa required jud nga minimum rate ang ipasweldo unya mohatag pa jud sila og incentive travel so dili na jud kayo na siya attainable so you really have to think pud incentive travel nga reward is only applied to those countries nga were in ang kanimo to those companies nga were in sa country kung asa ni siya na locate nga company very healthy ang ilahang economy okay So of course, if the economy is quite healthy, say lahang a country, and then the company there is also like thriving, no? Yeah, ko an po siya, dagan po kasi sila o kanang budget for for incentive travel. Then that could be ko ano po di juk ayus sila ka offer ano nga kind of reward. Next is buying power, strength of the exchange rate in the countries being considered as a destination for the trip. Siguro, let's just say. If the company is really not that, atong ibo tang hadili kayo yung anak ga earn. Pero ang destination kung asa nila i offer to ang ang trip is sa Philippines naman. So ang exchange na is cheaper ra. So okay ra kayo. But if your company is not really earning that much money and ang destination kung asa ihatag ang incentive travel is, of course, yung reward is a paid expense trip to, let's say, Venice or sa koan sa UK, so of course, maglisod put ang company ano na because the exchange rate is really quite expensive, ang euro compared to dollars, de ba? So mapon na siya no strength of the exchange rate in the countries being considered as the destination for the trip. If ang company is in the US and their trip is in Thailand, knowing that it's really cheaper in Thailand, then of course. Considered po siya as one of the factors behind incentive travel decisions. No kay makaya raman silang buying power. No kay ang exchange rate sa Thailand o sa U- within sa US dollars. Kuan man. Para to raman. So political climate, travel alert for destinations with political turmoil. 
safety and security. So terrorist alert levels after the 911 incident. So sometimes it is not highly advised to have incentive travels, especially if your company um, is really quite sensitive when it comes to the safety and security of their employees. Labi na if mga destinations are really not that quite safe, no? So next is value. How do facilities and services compare with other choices of destination? And then uniqueness of experience takes into consideration whether these participants have experienced this type of trip before. So of course, it's the uniqueness of the experience. No? Because if you're going to reward an employee a trip to, let's say, a trip to New York, niya, taga kuan na siya, taga US siya nga, New York, raw mo lang, di mo kasi siya worth ito. Hindi lang gulo kong magnaning. Okay, kay, if dili ko magnaning, makatraba, makabiyahir man siya ko sa New York, no? Because I've been there a couple of times. So, it's not really that unique of a reward for me. O, di ba? Smupo na siya, no? So, uniqueness of experience. So, for example, wala pa siya kaagto sa, like, sa Bahamas or sa Maldives. So, niya, di ra na, <laughs> maningkamot siya. So, maningkamot siya kung ma-perform o maayon no, kay para ma kakuan da yun ko. Um, makabiyahe ko sa Maldives or yung ana. At yung k-drama nga wherein ang ilaha po nga reward is sa unsa to siya nga lugar pero in Korea naman po to. So, okay mo sila ato no because siguro expensive ang actor Jeju Island mag siguro to siya. No, so, you consider the uniqueness of the experience. If your company cannot actually afford um, a very unique destination wherein it's not common for for everyone na the same time and you can afford it no your buying power then you can really have like incentive travel again not all companies can afford incentive travel and if they can really afford sometimes it will be based on a destination no at sa mga cheaper countries and sometimes it, it may not be like a unique experience to the employee anymore because they've already been there so dagan kay consider ana Manooban ka po, yan na sila kayo. They have to organize the trip. So, ban kay monetary na lang or ilang i-promote. No? Ang another way of providing incentives to their employee. Okay, next is ang convention. So, similar to meetings, conventions are gatherings of people with common object objectives, organ organized exchange ideas, views, and information of common interest to the group. An organization, usually an association. So, this will organize a convention each year with a theme related to organization's topic. Same with your SC, di ba? Nga, they have like similar interests, which leadership and all, no? Or um, like steward leadership, nor in you are a leader, but you serve. Ang mga ilang mga main themes air SC. And then, honestly, mga theme theme. So, ba tong theme ka ro, no? Oh, for example, um, katong last time tong college kay. Soldiers of Christ, wala hangi tawag yun. Nasa Limerick theme song, theme song po ato, no? So, there is also like a registration fee. Kaya, nga naman, nga naman may mga registration fee aning mga conventions, ma'am. Because you're paying for the stipend of the speakers who are invited sa kaninga convention. Of course, they will be speaking po, no? If na aman, mga talks. Um, if na may mga field trips, so you're going to pay like the, the tour guide, no? Or the tour and travel company. Um, the meals, no, na prepared throughout the convention. If it's a week-long convention, then meals dira, no, pagkaon pala ni mo daan. And even the materials that you use, like, na na mga kit, no, like, a t-shirt baron or your kit nga na ay ka ng uh, mga handouts, notebook, oh, ang rent pud sa lugar, kung asa mo nag-convention, apil pud bihan na ang sound, gabayad mo sa electricity, sa tubig, sa, sa sounds, Oh, sa mga employees nga ga-organize ana. Okay, in particular convention consists of a variety of events include congresses. So mo na siya no. Congresses, conferences. So ang congresses kay large scale regular trade gatherings, ang conferences kay small scale and aimed at information sharing. Then yun conferences na apo no. Conferences with small exhibitions. So na ay conference a day one day to exhibition so mga different like stalls then ilahang i present nila ilahang like invent abi ato ibotang na ay conference about um technology no mga technology mga innovations so na mo discuss ana sa day one talk regina siya sa dipok adlaw day two 
magsuray-suray mo sa exhibition kay tungod ang kanang mga bag-o nga, nga innovation sa technology kay kada stall no ilahan ng uh, marag i sa tawag na um foggy kay kung brain kay katulong kay ko class kanang ilahan ng i-exhibit na nanako sa kuno i-demonstrate to ilahan ng i-demonstrate no nga for example no, na ako ka ng new robot diri nga ko ani ako na i-demonstrate so manang confexes no mga conference siya mixed with exhibition and then one to one events like premium networking so all conventions can be organized at a different level so it could be international wherein you have participants from different countries national so within the country or regional within the region sometimes it could be like local ano within your city Okay? Mga po na ilain, no? So, pag-hamster conventions man na siya, no? Ang Congress, so, makaya siya na, na, na elaborate further. So, ang Congress has, other C po na kay Tulum na asla kasi, convention, Congress, o conference. So, ang Congress class is a regular gathering of people who belong to religious, cultural, professional, or other associative groups. A Congress is often staged to shed light on a particular subject, question, or issue. So, for example, there is like an issue you would like to discuss, and then you want to discuss it with groups of people who that have that have different um outlooks no on this kind of issue. So sometimes it will last several days. Okay. So a term Congress is really often like a very popular um for associations no. You can even see that sa politics, no? Forward ka. Or saan iba? Now, in, you discuss a certain issue. Or like, for example, you would like to implement a certain program, no? Implement mo siya for, for the community baron. So, gusto na niyo i-lobby sa Congress or etc. Discuss na niyo, no? So, there is like a, a gathering of people that will discuss on a specific issue or program. And at the end of that, they will find a resolution or a solution, or for example, kuan lang, no? If it's going to implement this program or not, no? So, muna siya ang sa Congress. Next is um, conference. So, a, con a conference is a scholarly gathering. So, usually, no, in the academe, na may ubang industries po, you know, like, like even mga mga doctors would even have like a conference no because to share no their like new medicinal breakthroughs or for example mga new medicinal um new medical practices ilang i-share sa mga other doctors so it's very scholarly siya no because it's an exchange of views and also to convey a message sometimes there is also a debate no on opinions and specific issues so most conferences are for study purposes. So we have like a conference to discuss, no, um, like this new medical practice, no. Let's see if it's applicable for, for, sa ato po nga practice as doctors, no. Yung marapod siya, mas very academic ang, ang tone sa conferences, no, compared to congresses. While ang convention is more on like sa mga associations. So, mo na ang difference nila ba? Ang congress is sometimes it's very political, ang yung tone. Conventions, um, is intended for like associations with similar um ideas no or similar views or common interest while conferences are usually for study purposes and sometimes it's very academic no very scholarly because it's gathering of information exchanging of information so yung ana i'm oh, sorry elaborate sorry na to so, the major differences between a meetings and convention is that a convention is a large event lasting for several days and involving a social program. Meetings only last for a couple of hours um, compared to conventions. Nor in it, sometimes it would last like a week. No? One week or two weeks. Not unless if it's a workshop. Na, no, nga, dugid siya. Workshop sometimes would last... Uh, karun kay, because of the pandemic, ang mga workshop gi shorten siya to, to, to three days. Pero ang mga workshop so na day is umbot lang, no? Kasi like ko naka workshop ko almost a month. Kay, kung magud siya go, dili magud siya ingon nga nari o sa katao nga mo feed din yung information. Kung workshop siya, ikaw po mismo magtrabaho ka. Kaya na ganing mga klase po ba? Para sa kung ginabuhat ninyo nga, mo discuss ko on sa ni siya. 
ayun, I will have activities that you will complete. Then right after the end of the workshop, you will receive a certificate, meaning you have completed the workshop. You have graduate ka ani nga workshop and you have the skills already, no? Nga natin nimo from this workshop. So may nakalhayan lang. Ang convention is just like feeding of information, exchanging them, but there's not actually actual work done by the audience nga may mga activity sheets or magto sila og kuan kay maghimo sila powerpoint or a plan wala man so mo na ang kalian pod usahay no so ang conventions one week ra siya ang pinakadugayan usahay ako na bantayan no and then ashay program no nga kinafollow unlike sa meeting nga agenda for the day ra and sometimes you can just discuss that within like two to three hours or sometimes five hours but ang conventions one week siya lahi ang activity sa day one day two day three day four okay so it's organized by associations no? like for example professional and trade associations or or like dentists no like association for dentists or teachers so associations with common interest so association or voluntary associations and societies so sometimes um these are um, organized by charities, political parties, and usually conducted once a year. Um, others would do it every month. Pero so far, ako na yun duman. Quar- quarterly naman na ang frequent jud nga time to have a convention. Other than that, it's done once a year jud. Now, considerable amount of the time spent on site selection of the convention. Of course, no, it would take a lot of organizing this kind of event. It's, it would be for a week, and you have to really organize a meal plan. Mas, mas intricate a meal plan. Ani kay unsa man ato ang meal plan sa day one, day two, day three, day four, day five. Nya, yeah, unsa mga materials si didla sa day one activities. Day two, day three, day four, day five. Ba? So, mo na siya. Exhibition. So, ang last E. No? Exhibitions are activities to show new products, services, and information to people who have interest in them. So, kung nakita niyo itong video to la- kanina, no, nga, we're in, maram mar- mar- ba ot- automobile nga exhibition kay na ay mga stalls, na ay mga vehicles, no, siguro sa kalain-lain nga brand, siguro sa vehicle, and then ilang i-showcase ang mga bago na nga, nga model sa sakyanan. So, um, sometimes, mga businesses ni siya nga mo offer og dira nila ipakita ilang mga new products no or ang uban ganing exhibitions kay dili imagine business type no na may uban nga like books no or for example food expos no like mga mga restaurants would go to food expos kasi like ko again I, I did mention this one before i don't know if dire ni nga klase nga i also participated in an expo before kay ang amuang hotel kung aso ko nag OJT nagpili siya mga selected nga OJTs to come with with the um COO no to organize like a booth booth among tawag ano sa sa expo sa SM dito sa Mandawi o niya na ah, may certain booth dire panindutay may kada hotel kay para mo attract og mga you know mga shoppers sa dagat ano mga pamphlets niya mong i-highlight ang unsay mga nindot nga facility sa mong hotel para ma-encourage sila mo check in no? so puna siyang mga example anang exposition so may mga stall or booth na siya so sometimes um in exhibition the company shows their new products the exhibitor typically rents an area from the organizer and sets up a booth to meet with potential buyers. So, ang mulan tao, there are more respected sa exhibitions are potential consumers or buyers. No, The buyers or the public need an invitation or a ticket to be allowed into the exhibition. So, it's not really open for all. No, Only those who are invited to the exposition or exhibition. So, so many ang purpose exhibition. So, get sales lead, new product introduction. So, man siya na mag-launch of new product build a network for influential contacts. So, this is where you will also meet new partnerships because there will also be other businesses nga will will participate in the exhibition and they will just look at other booths and then if na sila makitan nga booth nga interested sila, no, they will even contact or mga sila contact details and okay, interested sila to build a partnership. no. And you can even gather the latest information about the competitors because, again, you'll be sharing like, um, a whole convention area with them or exhibition area with them and then tapad gay mo usahay no may times tapad mo kay para sa katong sa exhibit na mo sa SM ato no kay 
diri mga restaurants gatapok diri mga hotels so magtapok mi sa uban hotels lantaw din mi unsay na adto sa ilaha no so open na siya and even build the company's image because it's a perfect time to do marketing no because marketing and again no can be in so many forms sometimes you can do it online and if you're in um how they call this if you're invited to an exhib exhibit no so i-grab po na nimo kay of course daghan mo ang tug SM diba So, yan, na, na po dira ang mga, mga businessmen. So, at least, kuan po, no, makita po ng imuhang business. Mungo na ito ang gihimo, di ba? If you can remember, tourism students, when you were in second year, we had our tourism booth sa plaza, di ba? Ang, ang gi-invite ato sa exhibit, kay, or sa exhibition kay ang mga tourism establishment sa San Carlos City. So, we really grabbed that opportunity to have a booth nga ga exhibit sa tuang department because it's some form of a marketing man po no nga we can also build our department's image and really it did help because if you look at the second year now no katong pagsulod nila ubay ubay pod biya sila ato industry association so international association for exhibition management is one of the associations that um like sets regulations for exhibitions no or for example even help Um, those pot potential places nga ginahan sila mo host po ng exhibitions. So, depending on the size and type, exhibition could be categorized into public, namely business to consumer. So, B2C. So, pa, uh, business to consumer na type of exhibition like trade shows, no? like car shows or fair, like book fairs or exposition or like food expo. Naapoy, business to business. So, ang business to consumer na si mag-set up silang booth in hopes of, you know, encouraging a potential customer. Pero ang B2B, meaning business-to-business -business exhibition, is will set up ko a booth in order to gain a potential partner for my business. So, na yung mga trade shows like Global Source Gifts and Home, Trade Fair, like for example, Fashion Access, and Trade Expo, like International Outdoor and um, Tech Light Expo. So, naapo tayo combined or mixed show. So, kanin combined or mixed show, mo ni siya ang um, combination of open siya sa public to consumers, open po siya sa mga businesses no, or, or, or corporate partners. no So, combination na siya nga. Pwede siya B2B o B2C. So, most combined or mixed shows will have different specific visit time for each group of attendees. Because, again, nila, hay man na sila o behavior po. No? So, ang B2C, for example, Monday sila. Tuesday ang B2B. Okay, mag week long abi siya nga exhibition. Okay, so nakasabot ra, class, sa uh, content sa my tourism. Yes, lang. Yes, lang. Okay, so let's continue to the different types of meeting, no, or ko ano, at least na pag may idea ba on si itsura niya. So, mani siya ang itsura sa Congress kasi no, it's, sometimes it can be an international meeting or event generally referred by Americans, no, or even here din na, ano man tadi, ano mga Congresses na we're in. Tingnan lang ikong nung gitawag siya air SC Congress, nga di naman siya Congress, not unless if, ah, uh, you know, Naman tayo time sa ARSC po nga we're in. We revise the handbook. So, namin mura po namin judicial system nga na amin mga resolutions i-present. So, mapod siguro itong itawag siya Congress. But not all the time that we do that activity. So, it's more of like a convention. no Okay. So, this is an example of like a Congress. And this is a seminar. So, ang seminar is very small lang ang iyong audience. no Limited ang iyong compared to like ang bigger ko an uh, bigger um, audience like a symposium ang sa seminar is na ay usa ka person expert ba ni siya sa certain topic nga mo discuss siya og yang mga experiences sa particular field kung asa siya na expert so siya lang mo discuss din maminaw ra ang audience and selected ra siya no very selected participants ra dili jud ingon nga daghan compared to a symposium workshops like what i've said no It's a session with groups or participants training or uh, uh, training each other to gain new knowledge, skill, or insight into a problem. So generally, that's a 30 to 35 pack. So mara po siya og lecture. No? So unlike sa seminar nga, ga receive rag information no, si audience, kanina naaji participation si audience ani because they will be able to like do activities. So na ipa-activity si, si speaker baron 
or si trainer, wala mo tawag na sa workshops, no? So, ila po nang i-complete, no? Dapat, yun, humbanon nila within the workshop because they will not be given, like, credits or, for example, kuan, dili po sila tagaan o certificate of completion. You see that among teachers of like, person na mga inset, those are examples of workshops because not only we are listening to an expert, but we get to also make, like, our own curriculum map, we have to make our own like curriculum guide no so that's a workshop already next is a forum so a forum is a panel discussion taking opposite sides of an issue by experts in the presence of an audience this is more of like a very formal debate no but we don't call it like a debate because they're not really like um discussing aggressive um arguments with each other no lahara is for example um, a member sa panel is they have different views on a specific kind of topic and si moderator, iharang pangutan on sila sa ilaha mga perceptions aning a topic and sometimes there would be a time nga they will not agree with each other but it's done in a very formal way. No, kana mar- Ga-discuss na siya sila. Next symposium. So, a panel discussion is given in the presence of a large audience. This is similar to a forum. There is still a presence of a panel. So there is also like um, a moderator wherein an issue will be presented. A symposium is not only limited to kuanha, to businesses. Nagani ka ng mga comic book symposium po nga wherein they discuss like like mga fictional characters, no? Um, like comic book illustrators would like discuss that among themselves they have different views on a certain character and then someone would ask them from the audience and they do that sometimes so and i know different kinds of like topics should be shared during a symposium so again our topic it discuss like for example like vaccines no discuss them health slug symposium vaccines um do vaccines work no there will be like a panel that will discuss that no um a lot of them will agree. A lot of them will tell you about the implications and all, etc., etc. So the kind of, it's just a sharing of insights from experts. So all of these people here are um, sitting down are experts, and then there will be people from the audience uh, who will be asking questions. So nakalahi lang niya from the typical forum or like a seminar is that daghan og tawo, no? So dinhi mo siya matawag nga forum ra kay daghan na mga kaayong tawo nga ning attend. So hindi mo siya symposium na. Next is a panel. So, a panel is sometimes invited to a forum or to a symposium. No, So, these are two or more people in a discussion supported by a moderator. These are experts. No, Sometimes they're experts in different fields and they share insights. Again, some of these insights uh, will not go along with each other. No, Pero that's the purpose of having like a panel. No, It's much a plethora of different ideas. No, nga, Ako lahi akong take about ani nga issue. Iya, yeah, lahi po lang yung take ani nga issue. So, yung ana. Ang lecture is a formal presentation by an expert followed by a question and answer. So, somewhat like a seminar, but um, the audience is allowed to ask questions. Like, they actually allotted one hour or two hours for question and answer. Unlike a seminar, although there is still a time to ask questions, but oh, very limited ang time na as mga 30 to or 15 to 30 minutes ra. Ang lecture should is discuss, discuss, discuss. Then I one hour exchanging of like questions and then, you know, the expert has to to answer it. Sometimes this is done in, in college classes in the U.S. No, mga, mga, mga type no, hatag siya lecture on this kind of theory, no, etc. etc. So, okay, so we're almost done. No, sa introduction, I omit the three per sige lang. Tung humano ni siya. A product knowledge of mice. So business travel is a major source of revenue for airlines, taxis, and car hire. Hire hire service providers as well as hotels. A tourism product, including mice product, is a combination of heterogeneous elements separated in time and space, assembling in interrelated services and products. Mice also has significant positive economic impact on individuals, smaller specialist suppliers such as florists, audiovisual companies, and photographers. And that is true, no? That is why I was I was really interested to study on mice because it's more than just like a business activity, no? It helps generate a lot of like advantages, no? Sa locals and even in the tourism industry, kay 
again, kung mag-organize kag dako kay nga mais event class, dili mong good na siya ingon ra nga na ana kay hotel dira na catering na akay conference room, solve na ka. No. You have logistics, no? Apil na po dira ang transportation, attractions kay of course, no apil ba ang incentive travel. Nya, na man dira mo attend og mais activities nga after sila hang pag-attend, pusuroy man jud na sila, di ba? You have florists, di ba? Kay everyday na activities, we need to have like fresh flowers as decoration for the like the stage or the conference room. Audio visual company, sound system, photographers, kay of course you to document those activities. Daghan no even local businesses like farmers can even um what they call this? They can even benefit from my events, no kay they will supply Like, for example, mga ingredients sa catering services. Appeal po ng mga local businesses nga. For example, gabaligya kung mga local uh, mga local delicacies diri sa San Carlos City. Yun niya, ang um, mga organizers, kwaon ko nila a supplier kay gusto sila nga ako'y mo supply og like peanuts or delicacies sa San Carlos City as souvenir or gift basket sa mga ni attend sa mice events. So, yung anak palang daan, di ba, daghan na juga ayo siya. You have events companies. Of course, you're going to hire event organizers. You're going to hire, um, what do you call this, tour and travel agencies, no, to accommodate, you know, potential mice participants. Daghan ka ayo, no, and you're even going to hire, like, additional people. Kaya ato ibutang daghan ka participants. So, kinalan ka additional waiters, no, mga on-call nga, nga hotel, um, staff, di ba? So, it really helps um, generate a lot of income to the host destination. And it has, a, again, it has a positive economic impact on on those who are involved in maestrism. Kaya daghan jud kayo siya og need jud class. Knowledge and innovative solutions are required in order to offer products from the mice industry, which will provide both professional and memorable experiences which will turn into many benefits for both participants, organizers, and des and destination. One thing that is also an advantage of hosting a MICE destination because not only does it, you know, help generate a lot of income for the people in that host destination, but it can even, you know, advertise your city, diba? Kaya mga so, ay, not kaya itong mong kuan, dito may nag-seminar sa San Carlos, doon kaya ito ilahang lugar, like, hopefully, nasunod na po na mga, org, nga, mga meetings or, like, congress, kaya dito na po ni Magkuan, dito na po amo ang, amo ang, mag-meetingan, or sa ba na siya. But you look at Iloilo City, no, a lot of, of, no, from, from Western Visayas are coming in Iloilo City because sila na ang mag-center sa, sila na siya ang venue, siya ka na na ay mga, like, regional conferences, na regional nga meetings or gatherings. Sila na ang center sa kanang mga ingana, no? sila na ang main road nga destination because they have very good facilities there. No, ako na kailang convention center ko. Kakita ka sa very beginning sa video sa um, mice in the Philippines. Katong dako kay convention center class sa Iloilo, beto siya. So, Muna siya, no? Kanang maka-advertise po sa inyuhang lugar. It helps um, improve the attractiveness of your of your destination of, or of your city. So, the creation of high-quality mice product requires the cooperation of diversified entities, which include meeting planners, venue-finding agencies, accommodation owners, PR agencies, and event management companies, associations organizing conferences, catering companies, Supplier of exhibition like furniture, flowers, stand constructors, interpreters. No, labi na if you're going to organize an international um, conference, di ba? Telecommunication facilities, conference exhibition center owners, just to name a few of them. Some of these entities identify themselves with the local tourism industry only to a small extent. So these cooperating entities create a kind of MICE network. So... In line with the value chain definition, a tourism product consists of its production, distribution, and marketing being configured along a value of chain involving many activities which are vertically, horizontally, and diagonally related and integrated in varying degrees. So if you're going to look at the different mice products, you can just name one product under mice tourism. No? Daghan ka ayo siya class na tayo. Provisions of travel information. Ano ko i-zoom in? Makita ninyo. 
So you have provisions of travel information, reservation and booking, transport to the destination, of course, di ba? No, kay kinalan po bitag transportation. Provision of information at the destination, like marketing, location of accommodation and food, provision of man-made tourism attractions, return transport to sending region, so back and forth nga transportation, after sales services, hospitality, freedom of choice, involvement, program handling ability, responsiveness to participants' needs, language fluency of convention staff. So you need to train, of course, no, your convention staff. Technology, comfort and convenience of transportation service, size of meeting, exhibition, or banquet room, speed of follow-up by convention staff, accessibility, Extensional location, air and road connection. So, dapat, no, everything is very accessible, no, from the conference or convention site to the accommodation, sa kananan, sa tourist attraction, and even sa mga terminals. Amenities, no, so, other facilities nga kinahala ni gas, like spas, sports centers, nightlife, like light, nightlife events, no, food and beverage services, other attractions. Image as a desirable place to visit. Reputation for hosting successful events for tourism in general, safety and comfort of visitors, support services to events, and number and type of local organizations and business capable of hosting. So again, so many my tourism products. Okay, again, you need a lot of things, no, to become like um a uh, successful my. share ninyo ang katong important it is to be really ready as a my destination needs a lot of preparation no? and that's it no? that ends my discussion for the introduction to mice we will have like a thorough budget na discussion on mice to reset followed by an activity next meeting i will introduce to you the event concept paper and evaluating a uh, criteria for evaluating mice venues so, gamay naman na three Cs naman, cost, convenience, and charm. Uh, Pilan na po na ko itong showcase, uh, pakita po itong ASEAN nga checklist for my destination. Questions before you will end. Hello? La Radam. Pohon dam, daghan with questions. <laughs> Pohon lang. Tingobon lang din yun niya. Yeah. Sige lang, sige lang. Okay, so before we will end, I would like to also ask, no, so please make sure, okay, because um, prelim is fast approaching, it will be like three weeks from now, siguro, maybe in the second week of September. So, kung lang ha, um, please make sure that you contact some of your teachers, no, like, mom. Via so that you can already start with your activities Kuan now before. Ba? Yes, yeah, na na ko siya dam. Si Ma'am mm -hmm. Via sa koan group ha. chat. Then nag, okay. nag chat po gudid do. Then wala man siya nag reply. Wala mm -hmm. siya ning scene. Mm -hmm. Wala po sa mo ang my friends sa iya ha sa Facebook. So, mm -hmm. sige, me sure kung unsa on siya pag approach. Reach out. Oh. Sige lang, I will. I will just chat, Ma'am Via lang po. No? Sige, naara to siya yung message request, Dam. <laughs> oh, di niya makita. Oh. Ma'am po na akong nakita itong sa senior high. Dugay na ko gi sa grade 12 ng GC niya. Wala ako makita kayo na lang sa message request. So, um, I will just have to inform her nga naging mo na ang GC. Kasi hindi po to siya pangita po ninyo. Yung mag siguro wala mo na ka kuan ba. Nag-abot kita ng anang dili po mo friends. And sometimes dili active siguro si Ma'am Via po. Kay busy sa ihang kids. So, ako lang po siyang i-remind nga na anay group chat. Check na lang sa message request niya. Okay, Dam. Thank you. Okay. So, thank you so much, everyone. Um, again, I will not be at school until September 1. I have my research workshop sa August 31 to September 1. So, if you have concerns na you would like to discuss with me personally, nara ko sa school in ka September 2. Other than that, you will just have to contact me through Messenger. Okay, and then pahaway pa po dahil ko ron kayo, no, pa-vaccine po ko, mo nang September 2, rajog ko ma makita ninyo. So, kung nang may mga concerns with regards to your schedule or other teachers, nga, we'd like to discuss with me personally, you will just have to visit me on September 2. 
Nya, busy ko sa, sa, sa August 31 to September 1. So, basin niyag, dili ko katubag sa inyong mga concerns. Um, for, again, let's, uh, um, let me just reiterate what I said yesterday. Um, please make sure to work on your research title. You will submit that on Thursday next week. That's September 2. So, August 31, we don't have class for research. All you need to do is just meet with your classmates, kamutanan, nga under sa research interest, and then discuss what kind of research titles you would like to present and discuss how to defend it. Hi, defend yun na ninyo. Ngano kani akong gipili nga research title? And why we are interested to pursue this this research? So, kana ara? Okay? Hey, Dam. So, naalam man ito kung gi-suggest gi duha ka book title last time. Na, Nag-i-record naman ako akong session gahapon. You can just go back to that and then kung ginahan mo, at least usan na lang inyo hang idungag nga research title. Okay, so thank you so much Duhan everyone. Duha na mo research, Dom. Ha? Wala duha na, na mo research. Wala okay, duha na ba? That's good. Dom, lisod ko ayong sauso, Dom. On sang uh, subject. I wait lang. Strategic planning. Oh, let me Marketing. just stop. Let me just stop recording first.